Good evening and happy Friday. Thanks for joining us. I'm Roly Hoyt. Faith getting some well-deserved time off. As we get closer to the start of another school year, there's a growing push to address cell phones in the classroom. Teachers, lawmakers, even the governor are sharing their concerns. And tonight, T311's Carter Thweet tells us more about where this debate stands. Right now, it's summer, which means classrooms like this one are empty. And empty classrooms also means no phones in the classroom. Now, some Arkansas lawmakers are trying to make sure it stays that way. The statistics seem to get worse every year. One of the biggest culprits are phones and social media. In that video posted to X on July 2nd, Governor Sarah Sanders announced a plan to give money to Arkansas schools to provide pouches for students to store phones in during the school day. And earlier this week, Arkansas Representative Bruce Westerman joined a bipartisan group proposing a similar bill nationwide. And it's something that we've dealt with, and I'm sure they're responding to uh, school officials that are saying that this has become a real problem. Whitehall Middle School Principal Les Davis says phones can be a distraction for kids, can also lead to bigger problems like picture taking, bullying, and even mental health problems for students. He says his school has tried several different things as far as allowing phones at different times throughout the day and he thinks the governor's new program could help. And we are, have applied for that grant, and I've done a lot of research on that. We're not gonna have the um, pouches uh, to start school, but we're hoping to develop uh, procedures and policies the first semester and have that ready to go the second semester. Some parents have expressed concern about not being able to reach their child in case of emergencies, meaning the debate over this idea will likely continue all the way into the fall. That could change as we find different things out, but um, we're, we're excited about it and think it's going to be a positive thing for our school. In Whitehall, Carter Thweet, THV 11 News. Carter, thank you. There's more to these proposals than just locking up phones. The governor's program would also add funding to help students improve mental health, and Representative Westerman's bill would include a study on the effects of cell phone use in the classroom. 